Huchigo Waits by Leslie Newman. Photo story by Ashton, Aubrey, Caitlin, Mary, and Victoria. This picture is when Professor Uno was walking to the Shibaya train station to go to work, but his dog Hachi wanted to stay at home, and Professor Uno was already running late, so he took Hachi with him. He asked the station master to watch Hachi when Professor was gone at work. When Professor Uno left on the train, Hachi ran away. The station master could not find Hachi since Professor Uno left to go to work. The station master was worried that Professor Uno would come back and Hachi wouldn't be there. The professor came back near 3 o'clock and saw Hachi's head. He patted his head, thanked the station master, and went home for a good night's rest. The next day, a little boy named Yasuo and his mother went to the train station and they saw Hachi waiting, but the professor wasn't there yet. They began to worry, so they waited for the next train to see if the professor was on it, but he still didn't arrive. It started to be late, so Yasuo and his mother tried to take Hachi home, but Hachi didn't want to leave his post. They got Hachi to go with them, but when they got home at first, Hachi didn't want to go inside, but he finally gave in. Yasuo and his father decided to take Hachi for a walk after dinner. But Yasuo's father didn't know of Hachi's strength, so when they opened the door, Hachi took off running, and they couldn't find him anywhere. But the next day, they found him at the train station. Hachi would always wait in that same spot every day and in every season, summer, spring, winter, and fall, for his professor. One day, a man in a suit came to the station and stood next to Hachi. Then he took a picture of him and then asked Yasuo some questions and wrote his answers down in a notebook. The next day, in the newspaper, it said, the faithful dog, Hachiko, sits at Shibaya Station waiting for his master and professor. The station master then declared that Hachi's name should be changed to Hachiko. Every day before and after school, Yasuo fed and took care of Hachiko. On a spring day, Yasuo arrived at the train station. Then the station master told him that Hachiko had been waiting there for his master for 10 years. When the station master and Yasuo arrived, Hachiko saw a train pull up. Hachigo barked four times and then collapsed on the ground. When the station master got there, it was too late. A year later, a statue of Hachigo was put up in the Shibuya station.